Yeah, it should be dry enough. I told you. Martha, you want to cut up some turnips? We'll be making soup. Mm, if it helps. Alfred, you go and look for water. We could just eat snow. No, it'll be proper water for my family. You sit, I'll... T Guess there's no use complaining. Too hard for my fist, but my pot should break it. Houses and sheds. Walls and roofs. Oh. I'd be glad. Should be glad. The year of our Lord, 1135, had come to an end. King Henry of England, son of William the Conqueror, had died. It was a time of poverty and death. In their despair, some had come to believe Christ and all his saints had gone to sleep. And that the pillars of the earth themselves had begun to crumble. to welcome us. Who goes there? You just crossed the bridge, right? That'll be a farthing for you and a penny for your horse. How dare you ask a toll from a monk? Do you know who I am, brother? Ah, the monk from the woods. That brother Paul said you'd be coming by. He said you'd bring cheese. It's not easy doing the Lord's work when you're hungry. It is not much, but I can share this with you. Now it will be easier for you to fulfill your duties. Oh, I'm sure it will. Will you take care of my horse, brother? I've come to see Prior James. 
Prior James? That's him the bells are tolling for. Leave the horse here. I I'll get it down to the Priory later. The fish should go nicely with that cheese. What? Why are they ringing the bells? <laughs> I think we have all understood the reason for your concern, Brother Philip. But before we come to a decision, let us hear other voices of concern. I would like to know why you would doubt the wisdom in Prior James's decision. Maybe you didn't know him as well as we did, Philip. I can say I knew him well. We all here knew him. I knew him well, and I know he would agree with me. Philip, you are going too far. I will tell the bishop about this. Brothers, oh, no, let him smile. Brothers, please. Oh, wow. Let's hear what he has to say. Oh, heavens. Hear him out, brothers. I was stubborn as well, but he made me see it. Well, that's not an easy thing to do. Here he is. I owe James much. He was the one who asked me to take care of St. John in the forest. One of the most prosperous cells in all of Shiring, if not England. It was a wise decision then. But his last wish was not. Well, was it? What are you waiting for? Answer me. Is walking on thin ice wise? <gasps> Who does he think he is? May the Lord forgive him. He knows not what he is saying. No. Philip was very hesitant to talk about the state of this priory with me. Usually he is as careful in his words as he is in his actions. Yes. Philip asked us a question. Was it wise to walk out onto the ice? God was testing Prior James. I say the devil chased him. Do you doubt that? Do you doubt that, Philip? Surely you must have an answer. I know because Prior James confided in me. If the Lord tested James, then he is testing all of us. I trust the Lord, so did James. And so should all of you. He was misguided when he walked onto the ice that night. As he was misguided in his last wish. Whatever or whoever misguided him. Maybe it wasn't the devil. We've never seen him. The novices would be better advised not to speak up. Philip is a good man. He was the only one to say I should have a fire. But did he do anything besides talk? No. So he did nothing to soothe your pain. He had only warm words. Very well, Philip. But why don't you tell us the real reason you have come before us? You not only came to save these books, you have another motivation, do you not? We deserve the truth. What are your true intentions? My brother is... Yes, I reminded my brother that Kingsbridge can use help. Look around you. This priory is in a sorry state. Please vote to save the prior's documents from the fire. It's the only way to help this priory. I say we leave the decision not up to a vote, but to Remedius. That is against the rules. Is it? He will be our new prior in a few days. Cuthbert declined, do you not remember? I remember well. And I say no one in Kingsbridge is better suited for prior than Remedius. <laughs> well, thank you, brother. Well, that's that's true. true. Hear, hear. I wonder why Cuthbert declined. Surely not. That said, there is someone not from our Priory. Someone better suited. 
I nominate Philip of Gwyneth to be the new prior of Kingsbridge. Oh, I can't I disagree it. with that. That's well, yes, why you're here. Yeah. Excellent choice. No. What about Remedius? Uh, that's surprising. Great Prior idea. Philip. <laughs> Brother Philip, do you accept the nomination? My name is Jack. For a long time, it was the only name I had known. I'm going to talk to some people. You and if you see something I can fix, let me know. You want to be like us? Like you? Tell you what, snatch us some food from the keep and we might train you. Very good. That should be a valuable first lesson. Then, help to clean out the empty houses and tend to the injured. You heard our prior, brothers. Take some bread. Only one loaf of bread for all of us? In Wigley they spat on us. And now you want to complain when this monk shows mercy. But I... Thank you, Father. <gasps> Children, take some food. 
Please, take it. You have to eat. Here, I will put it here. Eat when you're hungry. Take some bread for your children. This is not enough. He has more bread. I saw it. Please, our children are starving. Give us bread for our children. Please, give some to those give people it over to there. Us. We have Why nothing. did this happen? What did we our do Our children wrong? will die in this cold. Oh. Wake Please, up, oh. let us stay where we can work. <laughs> <laughs> There's a breeze coming from the back. and the devil. <laughs> they sent you back to punish me. I told them we must repent for what we did to you, to all of them, for my sins. Cast me into the lake of fire. A few weeks later, I received an invitation from Bishop Waleran. In Winchester, we and Waleran's allies were to meet King Stephen himself. The bishop seemed assured that, because we had helped the king, Stephen would support us in return. My Lord King, I thank you for being willing to reconsider the future of the Shiring Earldom. When shall we hear your decision? Tomorrow. Bring my bow. Tell the men we hunt. <laughs> Philip, Waylon and I have much to discuss. All right. But what can I do to help? Well, my brother asked me to get a confession from the traitor Bartholomew. A confession would be helpful against those who believe Bartholomew's arrest was unjust. And it may help us to convince my brother to forget all about his promise to Percy Hamley. <laughs> 